Vaccines have saved hundreds of millions of people over the last 40 years. They have side effects, but they have a remarkable safety record. In the last 10 years, there's been less than a handful of deaths from all vaccines given in the United States. All of the people who've gotten anaphylaxis to date from the vaccine have fully recovered, and they've only been about less than a dozen and a half to date in the world. COVID has killed over 350,000 Americans to date. That is approaching the total number of people that died in World War II. That's more than people who have died in all the wars since then. You have to think of this as comparative efficacy. What is my risk of taking a COVID shot that so far has proved to be remarkably safe compared to my risk of getting sick and dying from a disease that has killed 350,000 people and is on its way to killing many, many more as time goes on. And there's no comparison in terms of the risk benefit ratio. Nothing is 100% guaranteed and new problems can emerge, but they seem to be very unlikely in view of the fact that over 2 million people have gotten the vaccine and nothing really serious has been uncovered. That's why I urge everyone to take the vaccine. I know many, many people who have died of COVID. I don't know anybody who's been hurt by a vaccine in my last 10 years. We're tired of being in our homes all day. The vaccine is our only ticket out of our homes. This is our salvation, quite frankly. And that's why it's important that everybody does it because we won't get there unless a very large percent of the population gets immune.